All right, we're here with the head coach of the Winsboro Red Raiders, Coach Josh Finney. Coach, how are you this afternoon? Man, doing great. We had a great workout this morning. All right, so y'all are uh, getting ready to go for this season. But before we start talking about this upcoming season, I want to talk a little bit about last year. Now, uh, last year, 13-1, and one, regional finalists, 6-0 and oh in district play, and you're returning six starters on offense, five starters on defense. But just tell me a little bit about last year, 13-0 um, and oh record until, obviously, the playoffs. But talk a little bit about last season for me. Uh, it was just a magical season, uh, you know, just an unbelievable experience with these kids in the community. Um, you know, to have one of the best seasons ever in the history of the school, um, you know, had some really great players, you know, that we lost, uh, you know, my son's going to Harding, uh, lost a, a great player in there, also lost a great uh, wide receiver and Will Wilcox uh, went to uh, Henderson State to go play wide receiver and, uh, you know, had a slew, had a really large class of seniors that were some uh, great football players, you know, with some several other ones. Um you know, they had the ability to go on. They just chose not to. Um, but just some uh, great players, a great group of kids, fun group, uh, just a real – man, one of them seasons you, you just don't want to end. That's on me. Yeah, that's on me, Coach. Sorry. Um, unfortunately, though, that season did come to an end. It came a little earlier than you wanted it to against Malakoff. And I want to talk about the the new district now that you're in, kind of a new district. You've got Malakoff in that district now. So um, just talk about the district realignment this year, um, kind of how it didn't change a lot for you, but you added a, a big team in that district. Oh, no doubt. You know, we lost Pottsboro, which has been a uh, perennial uh, playoff team making deep runs. Lost them and then gained Malakoff, which has been our Achilles heel the last few years. And, uh, um, you know, and then I think we gained uh, lost Bonham and added Eustace as well. So other than that, the district stayed together uh, with Commerce and Mineola and Mount Vernon and Emory. Um, and so it, it's going to be a, a really, really tough football district. Um, some great football to be played in there. So, you know, we're excited for the – the chance. Well, let's talk about this year. Like we said, you got, you know, um, you got some re returning starters on offense, returning starters on defense as well to kind of build off what you did last season. Um, but you did lose a lot of key players as well. So what are your expectations coming into this season and, and how do you replace those players that you lost? You know, we've got a great young group, you know, undefeated JV and eighth grade group coming up that'll be freshmen. Uh, both them teams are undefeated. Uh, some really great young kids ready to step in and fill this, fill those roles of the guys that we left, you know, and, and not rebuild, but just keep reloading. Um, got some great talent, you know, some kids that have waited their time and, and excited to step in their role and don't want the opportunity to embarrass them. And they've been getting after it and, and putting in a lot of work. So, uh, you know, seize the moment is what I've been telling them, you know, that they've been waiting on. So, uh, just real excited uh, to watch another group of kids, you know, keep rolling. Won a lot of games here in the last five years and made some deep runs. So, um, you know, we, we got a bunch of kids um, that are ready to do that. And we talk all the time about Winsboro and the community support that you get from the Winsboro community. So just talk a little bit about the the fan support and the community support that you have. <laughs> you know, it's just an unbelievable atmosphere to come play in this stadium on a Friday night, um, you know, from the cheerleaders to the band, the drill team, I mean, this place is rocking. Um, it's packed. Um, you know, the, the, it's a great place. You know, I, I, I was got to graduate here uh, in 1997, got a chance to come back home and coach. Uh, you know, I'm coaching a lot of my buddies' kids now and that I went to school with. And, and so, you know, you know, my dad went to school here. You know, my boys went to school here. So, you know, it's just a really great uh, place. Uh, the community is just a very good community, um, you know, that loves helping kids and loves serving kids in every aspect. You know, I don't care what sport we're playing or, or what. You know, it could be robotics, man. There's a slew of help, slew of support. You know, uh, uh, love the kids here. Excellent. Well, Coach, thank you so much for taking the time and talking to us today. Best of luck this season, and we'll talk to you throughout the year. Thank you very much. Look forward to a great season. Thanks, Coach.